hi all today i am going to explain to you uh, what sql pivot and uh, unpivot is uh, sql pivot and unpivot is very simple if you understand the concept uh, so i will explain to you through an example see i have a table here with column names year product and sales on 2019 i sold apple for uh, 500 rupees on again on 2019 i sold another bundle of apple for 200 rupees on 2019 i sold orange for 300 rupees 2020 i sold orange for 400 and 2020 itself i sold apple for 100 rupees so i have a table like this now i want to pivot this table so uh, my requirement is i want to see uh, the sales of apple for uh, year 2019 and the sales of orange for year 2019 so um, uh, and for uh, same for 2020 so i want to see the sales of my product for uh, 2019 and 2020 so we have to assume in our mind how this output should look like so i i want my output to look like product that is apple orange and i want the uh, sales for 2019 and 2020 so i want the sales of apple for 2019 and uh, uh, sales of orange for 2019 and uh, uh, sales of apple and orange for 2020 so here actually what i want is the sum of sales on 2019 i can see apple uh, sales is 500 and 200 so for 2019 total sales of apple is 500 plus 200 that is 700 so i want the total that is sum of sales here so i want the sum of sales of my product for 2019 and 2020 that is my requirement but if you have a requirement like you want to find what is the maximum sales of a product that you got is then instead of sum you will write max of sales that means you want to find for uh, what is the maximum sales you got for one product for apple the maximum sales you got for 2019 is 500 if you want to find the minimum sales of one product then you use minimum but uh, anyway on when you uh, when you have to find a pivot uh, you have to use some aggregate function some minimum maximum or any other aggregate function so you are finding the sum of sales so making it clear i will write here what is the sum of sales for apple it's for 2019 it's 700 for orange for uh, 2019 is 300 for apple for 2020 is 100 and for orange for 2020 is uh, 400 so this is the output that i am looking for this is the pivot output that i want so how will we get to this output so the query i will write is i want this this is the output i want so i will write select select uh, what output i want select product comma i want the column names are 2019 and 2020 and that's the output i want 2020 so i wrote in select query the column names of my output from from where my source is this table from this table i am pivoting to this table so from this table so i will write give a name for this table uh, sales table okay so this table's name is sales table so from select star uh, from sales table okay this is my source we will give an alias as l and so we want product to the for, uh, for year 2019 and 2020 from our source table that is this table uh, but we want to pivot this table so we we'll write pivot pivot what pivot we, we are what, what we are finding here is sum of sales so that's what we are finding so we will pivot so we want to find sum of sales for what we want to find sum of sales for years year in 2019 and 2020 isn't it so for year in bracket in right 2019 and 
get 20. So we want sum of sales for year in 2019 and 2020. Let me give this table alias P. Okay. Divide it as P. So when we, when we write this query, uh, the output we will get is this. Okay. That's it. Pure pivot. Select product 2019 and 2020. That's the output we want. We can, if if we want like all the columns, we can also write select star from this table or uh, we want the specific uh, column names, you can give the column names as well. So I am writing, this is the output I want, so I write select product 2019 and 2020 from this source table, select star from this source table. I want to pivot this table, pivot and I want, what I want to find is sum of sales, so sum of sales. For what? So I want to find sum of sales for year 2019 and 2020. So that's the pivot expression. I hope it's clear for you. Now I will uh, uh, tell what SQL unpivot is. SQL unpivot is also very similar as SQL pivot. So unpivot is suppose we have a table like this. So this is our source table. So from here. We want to unpivot to this. So pivot is from here to here we are doing pivot. And from this type of table to if we want like this, we do unpivot. Okay. So in unpivot, how we want the data? So again, we have to assume how our uh, table should look like when we do unpivot. So from this table, we will assume we want the product column, product column. But we don't want 2019-2020 in column names, but we want it as rows under a column called year. So we, we write year and again 2019 and 2020 will come under that. And uh, this this cells, this cells, what is this? This is sum of sales. So we want the sum of sales uh, to be represented as sales, isn't it? So you can see Apple 700. But here, as we know, when we pivoted, we to took the total of Apple. But when we write the query, uh, we, we don't know like uh, whether this was a uh, sum or minimum or max. So we when we are uh, unpivoting, we are just simply finding the sales. So we can't uh, like uh, differentiate it into 500 and uh, 200. So there will be only one row for 2019 Apple and that will be 700. So for Apple, for 2019, 700. For Apple itself, uh, for 2020 it is 100, Orange 2019 it is 300, Orange 2020 it is 400. Okay, uh, I hope it is clear. So we are trying to unpivot from this table to this table. So like I wrote for pivot expression, uh, same thing in the select query, I will write what I want. So select I want year product and sales from where from this is my source uh, okay i will give a, uh, a name for this source table let it be uh, sales uh, by year okay this is my table name so select year product and sales that's what i want from this source table from select star from sales by year table. So this is my source. And what I want to do is unpivot. Unpivot. In pivot expression, we wrote uh, like an aggregate function like sum of uh, sales or maximum sales or minimum sales. But in unpivot, we want to find the sales. So we'll just write sales. For what? For the year. For year. For each year, isn't it? So here, for 2019 and 2020, we want to unpivot into a row 2019-2020. So for sales for year in 2000, year in square bracket 2019. 2020, these are the column names in this table, 2020, okay, so we did unpivot, that's it, so 
this is the unpivot expression so when we do this we will get uh, unpivot this table from this table to this table uh, i hope uh, you understand uh, what sql pivot and unpivot is uh, please let me know if you have any queries um, thank you for watching